Guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can enable or disable touch for guided access on the iPhone 13 series. First, let's go back to your home screen by swiping up at the bottom of the screen. And on the home screen, open up settings. In settings, you want to go down and tap on accessibility. Then we go down and tap on guided access. At the top here, tap on guided access toggle button to switch it off or turn it on. Once it is turned on, we can now go back to the home screen. Then we will open up a desired app that you want to use. So here I'm going to open up Roblox. Okay, in the Roblox game, we're going to start gather access by triple click on the side button. One, two, three. Then from the pop-up menu, tap on gather access. Okay, on the gather access home page, tap on options. And from the pop-up menu, tap on touch to allow or disallow touch. So you can see if I disallow touch or disable touch, the top screen is being grayed out. So let's tap on the start button and see what happened. So I tap on the start button now. Now I need to put in the passcode. I'll put in the passcode again. And that's it. So it says get access started, but when I press on the start button, now I cannot do anything because the touch screen has been disabled. Now this feature is particularly useful. So if you want to open up a video and then you play the video, but then you want to lock the screen so that if you hand over your phone to someone else or even to the kids, then they can watch the video, but they cannot change anything. They cannot press on the pause button. They cannot stop. They cannot um, change the, vol the volume. They cannot do anything on the touch screen. So let's see what happened when we, um, when we turn it off. So I'm going to go back to my guided access home screen and then tap on options. And then we turn on touch, then tap on done, and then tap on resume. So now that touch is on, you can see I can access the screen now. So let's take a look at another app where we can test it out. So I'm going to end here. Let's say I'm going to open up the YouTube app and I want to maximize the screen. And I can also press on the play button. Okay, so okay, it's playing, the video is playing at the moment and I can triple click. And then I will start get access. And I also going to lock it. So I'll put in the lock screen passcode and I tap on options, then I turn off touch and then tap on done, then tap on resume. So now the video is playing, but you can see that I cannot do anything on the screen. The screen is basically locked. So quite useful if you are playing a video and you are giving this to your kids, then they will not be able to mess around with the screen, but they'll still be able to watch the video. So it is an extremely useful feature. So to end the, the get access, I can uh, double click and use face ID to end get access. And now I can also post the video. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.